Always going well, as always. Uh, so happy Monday to everybody. Hopefully you're feeling fantastic after the weekend. Today we've got a, a little bit of a, I don't know, kind of lighter session, I guess. More, um, less intense than it will be tomorrow anyway. All right, so that's nice for you. It's going to get you moving after the weekend um, and we'll get into it. Okay, it's pretty simple. We'll run through it in a few moments. But first, let's just do some simple like mobilization stuff just to get us warm, loosened off a little bit. So first one. From here, just roll your hips from side to side, taking it nice and easy. Very uh, relaxed. Just try and get a little bit of a stretch as you go. <sighs> Charles is having a lovely lay down. Sizzler's legs come up. I would yeah. like to know the, the proportions of people that do your warm up versus the ones that do mine. Your cats and cows. Because, <laughs> I mean, mine seems more realistic. Mine's for me. I don't care about anybody else. <laughs> it's not true, people. I do care about you, but like a lot of this stuff is to help me get moving in the morning. Chelsea and I understand this when she gets to my age. He's been saying this literally since I met him. It used to be, <laughs> as soon as you turn 30, you'll know. Okay, you'll know um, exactly what I mean. You rotate it out and around, up the back. I turned 30 and it, I was still fine. And then he was like, well, when you turn 35, I haven't turned 35 yet, so I don't know. But, but if it's anything like turning 30... Yeah, I think she's just not recognizing it. That's the difference. If she's I'm saying, not recognizing continually saying like, it, then oh, it's really not that bad. No, my neck hurts. I don't I, understand I'm, why my legs hurt. My neck hurts. Why is my I'm back stressed. hurt today? <laughs> and we're not moving enough. That's the problem. Like sitting on the couch will do that yeah. to you. <laughs> Circle those hips. Nice big hip circles. Maybe you're just lazy when I'm not around, and that's why you hurt all the time. No, I mean it. It could be. I've got the opportunity to be lazy. And switch it to the opposite side. And change direction. As much as I love our couch, I really do think that like sitting on it is not that great for you. Push it back. Okay, bring your hey, shoulders over your hands. Stick. Just move through that movement. Feet forward, drop down into a low squat. Hook the fingertips or put the hands on the ground, Get straighten those legs, bend them down just enough so your ribs connect to your legs. And try and stay a little bit deeper each time. Between the baby and the dog, it's just a nightmare. <laughs> legs a little bit wider, drop it down, straighten those legs, so we drop, bring your arms up, put it down. And somehow the grass needs cutting again. I don't know how. Like, it's all this rain and sunshine that we're getting. I mean, half the grass looks like it could be on a golf course and half of it's dead. <laughs> I don't understand. Okay, guys, so we're going to jump straight into it. So today, pretty simple workout. You're going to go 10, 20, 30, 40. You go 10 rock squats. So demonstrate. I'll demonstrate a rock squat. So, rock squat's pretty, uh, pretty simple. Arms out, go along behind you. Probably you're going to uh, pull your feet in. Yeah, you're going to pull your feet in and you're going to stand up tall and then drop back down again. I had a brief uh, brain fart there. 20 press-ups. If you don't know what a press-up is, I can't help you. Uh, <laughs> you really, press-up you'd like to do. Or if you really want to, you can do a push-up if you want. I think that's the same thing. Uh, just the Americanized version. Supermans. You can demonstrate Supermans. No. Not good. You can do it. I demonstrate every day. It's your turn. It's <laughs> really. Supermans. You can do a couple of variations. Let's see if you can see me. Okay, you can go arms out straight. 
an up where this you can do a single arm like dragon. This is literally like the 70th one of these. Yeah, you don't know when people are coming in. Okay, mountain climbers. Uh, two ways. You can either do them as like the sprint version or the switch version. It's up to you. It's your workout. That's it. So 10 of the rock squats, 20 press-ups, 30 supermans, and 40 mountain climbers. Try and do as many rounds as you can in 10 minutes. Gonna set up my clock. We have a seven second countdown. Hopefully, seven everybody... seconds. I've forgotten the routine already. Rock squats are first. And, and go. Superman's right. Yeah. Funny of those. Dirty Superman's. mountain climbs. Awesome. Oh, my eyes are so itchy. <laughs> and Tom's hoarding all of the hay fever medicine. He's not hoarding any hay fever. We need to get some work. Oh, we just don't have any. Some in the bathroom and some in the kitchen. Yeah, but none of the stuff that's non-drowsy. Uh, all yeah. of it's non-drowsy. No, some of it makes me really sleepy. Oh dear, hay fever problems. I like the one that starts with C. <laughs> some of that in the drawer downstairs. Is it? Yeah. You put it there. I thought you used it all. I no. couldn't find it yesterday. It was
Oh, it's 30, isn't it? Yeah, three rounds done. Four hours left. Five minutes left.
five. So I got six rounds and six. Where do you get your six rounds? Two. I'm gonna run and grab some hay fever. Okay, so second part of our workout. We're gonna do a ladder from 10 to one, drop steps. So 10 drop steps, leg back, 10 bridges. So put your back bridging. And then final one is sprawls. So hips down to the ground. Yeah, I should know all of these. We do them um, a lot. So uh, it's 10 of each of those, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And goal just to do as fast as you can. Try and push quickly, okay? So this is a little bit of very fast movement, so it should be quite quick. Chelsea's now back, so we can get started. Okay, what are the extra Drop steps, drop steps bridges, and sprawls, 10 to 1. Shall we turn the camera so you can see our heads? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, here we go, guys. Stopwatch. And we're doing drop steps 10 on each side. Yeah. Can do. We're going to do drop steps. You do 10 on each side of the drop steps. Well, I don't know. I didn't know what you told them. I just said 10. Oh, okay. So we do 10 on each side of 10. 10 on each side. 10 on each side. Here we go. Just got a little bit more challenging. Not that much. Not that much more challenging. Ready? Go. Thank you. 
最后一个。Okay, we're going to our abs. So if you need to pause the video to finish, do that. If not, what am I going to do today? Jiu-Jitsu abs. Okay. Here we go. It's just way better than just trying to do 100 straight <laughs> because it's boring. Hands on the shoulder blades. Remember this time, try and keep the head and feet off the ground throughout. Toes together, knees together. My count. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Feet knees wide. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Head off the ground. Knees together. Toes together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Knees wide. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Legs up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. To your side. Go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Other side. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. De La Hiva position. For one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Both legs out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Go into your Sphinx pose. We're going to leave the reverse extensions because we just did a ton in the workout. So just come up onto your forearms and just hang out here. Nice guys. Okay. That was a pretty short workout. I'm gonna spend a little bit of time just stretching off my hips and lower backs. Lower back. We don't have multiple backs. So if you guys want to join in, feel free. If not, just do your own thing. Um, so the first thing, just come into this uh, kind of cross leg position here. All right, we'll go full cross leg. What you're gonna do is make a big circle all the way around. Try and keep your hips on the floor. And then switch to the other direction. Nice. Okay, now you can grab behind your knees, you're gonna rock back, pull yourself up. So this is just like a little bit of mobilization. We're trying to use our arms to pull ourselves in rather than our back muscles. Okay, now come on to all fours. Go through our cats and cows again. But we're going to do three variations. Just rolling down. Try and start with the lower half of the back and then roll it up both directions. No, it's okay. Now, go down to the forearms. We're going to do the same thing. Okay, it's so rounding here. All right, it's okay. Now, you're going to bring, like, kind of your chest down to your knees. And we're just going to try and do those shoulders. Okay, guys, 
Now, from here, go into this kind of half lotus position. You're just gonna lean forward. Try to so take a deep breath in, and then lean. Lean with your belly first, then your ribs coming down as low as you can. And then just stay here. Kind of move around a little bit if you need to. Keep those hips on the ground. Okay, now bring it over towards one knee. Okay, and then over to the other knee. Switch your legs around the opposite way. And then same thing. Deep breath in. And then lean forwards. Stomach followed by the ribs. Switch it over. We're going to go to a 90 90 stretch. So remember, get that uh, position here. Make sure your knees in front of your hip, 90 degrees in both. Same thing, big deep breath in. Go stomach first, falling all the way through into your ribs, and then maybe your head down. Back up. Same thing, but this time try and fold towards your foot. You probably won't go as low. Just going to lean over to your side. This leg's going to go out straight. In fact, sorry, this leg is going to stay bent here. You're going to reach away hard, as far as you can, really stretch it out, and then try and push your knee. So this is going to be my left arm stretching. I'm going to push my left knee away as well. And then from there, rotate down towards the ground a little bit. Okay, from here, bring this leg up, all the way over the top, leg can come in a little bit if you want, and then into our half Lord of the Fishes.
Yeah, and if you can, you can bring this leg in a little bit, pull the other one around the side. Let's try and stack one knee on top of the other, and just do a gentle lean forwards. And you'll feel this in a slightly different position. Try to relax, don't have any tension. Nice, come out. I'm gonna switch our 90-90 position to the other side. So remember, hip in line with your knee, other leg back. First one, breathe in, and then fold as you exhale. Okay, come back up, same thing, breathe in, and then we're gonna go towards our foot. Okay, get that leg back out, just come through. From here, uh, come to the side, so we've got this straight line in our side. We're going to reach up and away, try and drive our knee away, big stretch first into your side and then start rotating down. Bring it back in, and now uh, half Lord of the Fishes. So they come in over the top, sit up, and hug that knee. Okay, fold this foot in, bring the other leg across. Trying to stack one knee on top of the other best you can and then just fold forwards. We're only going to do one more stretch after this. One of my favorites. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's bring it out around. Okay, so now last one. Okay, so we're going to hug underneath. Our arms, you can hold onto your elbows, you can hold onto your wrists, whatever you feel comfortable doing. Connect the front of your body, chest, head, everything down to the knees, and then just like start slowly sliding your feet away, but maintain that connection. Once you get to a point that feels tight, or well, not tight, but like you're at a good range of movement, start to take really big, deep breaths in. And really breathe into your ribs, like in the back. Now. And if you can, go a little bit further. further again if you can. Nice. Relax there. Come back up. Nice training to you guys. As we said, that was a 
not super intense in terms of the workouts more getting you moving after being um you know stuck inside all weekend or whatever so i hope you guys enjoyed that found it useful um and we'll see you guys tomorrow morning bright and early around about nine o'clock